What's up guys? It's Alex from AJ's Lawn Care. In this video, we're gonna be talking about this uh, de-rusting wire, well, it's not really made for de-rusting, it's made for weeding. It's a wire brush attachment for your weed eater, basically. Uh, I've seen a bunch about them on YouTube and uh, got a couple of ads for them on Facebook and whatnot. Let's go ahead and get it out. I've got the, I've got the tool it comes with. Here's the thing, it's the six inch grinding disc or wire wheel it's pretty it seems pretty sturdy already let's see if nothing else in the box all right i've got the um i've got an allen wrench and let's open this bag see what else we got we've got um, an adapter we've got i'm not really sure what we'll do with these um it doesn't come with any instructions. It comes with these two things, um, this cover, and the wire brush. Let me go ahead and see if I can figure out how to install this. I'll get right back with you guys. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and attach this. It doesn't spin freely, which is weird. Um, I'm hoping it'll spin when I turn on the weed eater. Uh, I haven't tried it out yet. I literally just put it on. See how it's attached right here. It's got a big washer and a nut. Um, it's going to there. Uh, we got some grass over here. They were at my house, so we can test out on this grass growing out of the asphalt. Let's try it out. Um, I played with the brackets a little bit. See right here. We got the washer holding it on. It spins freely. All right, let's go ahead and try this out. So, first impression, a lot of vibration going on. Probably needs to be rebalanced. You see it's sticking out a little farther on the right side. Uh, let's look at the brushes. Well, it doesn't look like it's done anything to it. Shouldn't, considering I used it for about 15, 20 seconds. Um, okay, so over here, this is where I did it. See, it's torn it up a lot. It started kicking a little bit of rock, and I didn't want to hit the cars. This is where I did it, and again. Um, in the video I saw, they also showed it'd be good for getting dirt off the sidewalks like that. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put that to the test too. Okay, so here's the results. See right here, uh, I put in a lot of effort. You see the scrapes on the concrete. It's actually really clean. See, uh, right there I put in minimal effort. That's one pass, and that's not messing with it at all. So you can see, the more you work with it, the better it looks. Most effort, middle effort, least effort. Well, really no effort right there. Um, it's looking pretty good. We'll go ahead and take a look at these bristles. See how these look. Uh, they look all right to me. I don't really see anything wrong with them. I mean, I know I've only used them for about a minute in total between the two places I cut. Yeah, you see I got how I got it mounted right there. Um, but um, I think I paid 20 bucks for it. So when, next time I have a yard. Hey guys, so first impressions, what I got thinking right now, it's okay. Um, worth twenty dollars maybe i'm thinking maybe i could have made it at like home by maybe going to harbor freight getting a wire wheel for a uh angle grinder or something i'm not sure i might try that after this one runs out uh only complaints i've got is it's slightly expensive for metal one metal wire brush uh only other complaint i've got is that's hard to balance um it's a little difficult to figure out how to mount it's but it's different for every weed eater it's a universal kit uh, I kind of knew that was coming though. It was coming from China. So, you know, what can you expect? Uh, is, uh, what I like about it, I like how it, uh, like how it tears up the grass to the root. It, it pretty much just grabs the grass, twists and pulls it out from what I saw when I was weed eating. Uh, I like how it tears up the dirt too. It works pretty good. Um, I wouldn't say it's easy installation. I wouldn't say it's difficult. It's right there in the middle. It took me about 15 minutes to figure out how to do it. Like I said, it's different for every weed eater. Uh, would I buy this again? Maybe. Uh, if I can't make it my own, then yeah, I'll probably buy it again after these bristles wear out. Um, that's it. That's all I got for you guys today. I uh, hope you guys have a great day. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good one, guys.